hi guys welcome back again to my channel today i'm just gonna show you guys how i wash my wigs and then here what we're gonna use i'm gonna use this um organ oil shampoo and i'm gonna use conditioner i'm gonna use a white tooth comb a brush and a hanger to hang the wig once i'm done and a towel so those are the things that we're gonna need today to wash our wigs okay so let's get started I'm just going to be holding the hair in the parting area where I parted the hair because the hair is parted in the middle. So that's why I'm going to hold the hair because I don't want to lose my parting. So we're just going to want some warm water, not cold water, but not hot, like warm water. I'm just going to wet the hair before I apply the shampoo like you see me doing there. It's pretty simple because it's very important to wash your wigs because me, if I don't wash my wigs, I get pimples. On my face so once a month I usually wash my wig so I'm gonna use some shampoo I'm gonna give it one shampoo not two I'm gonna wash it once because the hair is not that dirty it's pretty the hair is kind of new I've had it for like a month and a half so it's fairly new so I'm just basically I'm just gonna zoom in so you guys can see what I'm doing there like you can see my thumb is literally, I place my thumb on the parting area because I don't want to lose the parting while I'm washing the hair. Because you know when the hair is wet, you can lose the parting. So, you know, just put your shampoo and I'm going to use the white tooth comb to brush the hair. You don't want to use a small, small tooth comb because you don't want to damage the hair and pull out the hair. And this might cause shedding, that's in my opinion. So that's what I'm using this comb instead of the small ones, okay? As you can see, the hair is not that dirty. Like I said, I've, I, you know, I've only had it for a month. And this hair doesn't shed at all. Pretty soon, guys, this hair will be on my website for you guys to order. Um, actually, I mean, I already have the hair in stock. It's a matter of me um, finishing my website. Once everything is done, you can purchase the hair on my website. This hair is pretty good quality. The cuticles are aligned. There's no shedding. And the hair is very full. I use three bundles and a closure to make this wig. Like I said, I've been wearing this wig for almost a month and a half now. And I just wanted to wash it because when my hair is dirty, it gives me um, pimples in my face. And I also, I have alopecia. So therefore, my hair has to be clean at all time. I'm just basically going to rinse the hair too. You want to make sure the hair is, you know, is rinsed properly. So you get all the shampoo out before you add the conditioner. As you see me, you know... Just follow along, you'll see. Just keep washing the hair out to make sure there's no tangles, there's no residue left behind. Like I said, I'm doing a little, you know, I'm going to zoom it in so you guys can see what I'm doing. Just going to continue, you know, combing the hair out. You want to make sure the water is clear. You don't want nothing left behind. No shampoo, no dirt, no oils. You want to make sure that you're going to rinse the hair until... The water is clear. As you can see, the parting is still there. You see how my closure is showing? I mean, it's looking. You can see the parting. Now I'm going to add the conditioner. This is a really good conditioner. You want to use, you want to make sure you're using good conditioner. Because you, like, when you have your weave or your wigs, you want to make sure you treat it just like your hair. Because, I mean, you invest your money in this. You want to make sure you're using good quality products for your hair. So... I'm just going to, so I shampooed it once and I'm going to um, condition, conditioner it. Oh my God, I can't even say that word, <laughs> okay? Okay, just follow along, guys, because sometimes, you know, English be, you know, throwing me off the struggle of being bilingual. So, pardon me, guys. So, you're just going to continue rinsing the hair. And like I said, you want to make sure the water is clear before anything else. Like I said, guys, this hair does not cause any shedding. There's no shedding. No shedding at all. I just want to make sure this hair is rinsed properly. So I'm going to go over it one more time. I'm just doing a little cleaning as I go along. Because I have a little OCD with when my sink is wet. I don't know why. but So, guys, yeah. So pretty soon, um, everything will be on my website. You can order this here. You can also have a wig made. I usually wash wigs for my client. Usually when I do wigs for them after a month or two months, they'll send the hair in to me and I'll wash it for them and curl it and send it back to them. And this is part one. Like I said, this is part one. There will be part two. This, I'm showing you guys how to wash the hair properly. Then I'm going to show you guys how to curl it and straighten the hair so we can apply it. This is part one. Um, Because... 
I would have do this in one video, but I don't want to make it too long. And I don't blow dry my hair like that. When I wash my hair, I let it air dry overnight. It's best to let your hair air dry overnight so that, you know, you don't cause any damage to the hair. So the hair is done and clean. So I'm going to use my hanger. This is the best hanger to use because it has two clips on each end. So you're just basically going to, you know, clip the hair in the hanger. And then you're going to hang it somewhere. You can hang it in your bathroom or by a window. Anywhere that, you know, there's air. I usually, I'm going to hang this by the window because, you know, it's hot here. And I will open the window and hang it near the window. And then by tomorrow, this hair should be dry. Like I said, like I said, guys, stay tuned for part two. So I'm going to show you guys how I'm going to um, one curl this hair and you no know, style the hair again. Because I can't do it today because I have to let the hair dry the next day. Okay. So here's the final result. You see how the hair is looking? The hair is looking all shiny. This is high quality hair. So yes, this hair can last up to two years. As you can see, this one is a 20 inch and 18 20 and 18 inch um bundles with a 14 inch closure it's pretty long as you can see the hair is very soft no shedding okay guys i hope you guys enjoy this video if you do please like comment subscribe share guys and stay tuned for part two thank you guys